หนังสือเรื่องราวลีลาของพระกิสนะนะคะอยู่ในบทที่ว่าองค์พระขวานกฤษณาที่เมืองอินเดียพระชัย So Krishna had to make a decision because we had in the previous chapter there were 20,000 kings all put prisoners by Jarasandha and they were kept in his prison house. ก็มีเอ่อที่เราอ่านกันไปก็คือมีพวกกษัตริย์เอ่อที่ Jarasandha 21,000 ปันลายเนี่ยที่ Jarasandha จับแล้วก็สุดท้ายก็ไปไอ้นี่ให้ตัวเองแล้วก็ท่านก็ไปช่วยมาคุณมาร่า sorry I I mute everyone please uh unmute yourself okay yeah so uh, at the same time Krishna got an invitation from Maharaj Yudhisthira that he wanted Krishna to come for his Rajasuya Yagna แล้วได้รับข่าวจากกษัตริย์ยูดิสทีว่าให้มาร่วมงานที่เขาจัดขึ้นเป็นยากยชนิพิเศษราชสุยยกิ So Krishna was discussing with Uddhava what to do. k r i s h n a ก็กำลังพูดคุยกับอุดาวายูว่าจะทำยังไงดี So Uddhava said that He has to. They have to do something about Jarasandha before they can do the Rajasuya Yagna. They have to first of all kill Jarasandha. แต่เด็กก็เลยบอกว่าพวกเขาเนี่ยจะต้องทำอะไรเกี่ยวกับเกี่ยวก่อนก่อนที่จะทำราราชสุริยะเกียเนี่ยเขาจะต้องทำอะไรกับ Jarasandha เสียก่อน Because Maharaj Yudhisthira cannot do the Rajasuya Yagna unless all the kings are subordinate to him. So Uddhava told them that they should disguise themselves as Brahmanas and go to Jarasandha and beg charity. Uddhava told Krishna and Arjuna and Bima that they should go to Jarasandha disguised as Brahmanas and beg charity. Um, problem not working. Arjuna, can you hear me? Arjuna. Huh? Maybe her. Maybe her problem. Arjuna, I, what happened? Did your internet go blank? Yeah, that's why I disconnected. I can't hear you. Yes, now okay, Guru. Okay, so I was saying that the uh, Uddhava said that they have to go to Jarasandha and ask charity from him. แล้วก็อุดาวาเนี่ยก็บอกว่าควรที่จะไปหาจารสันดาแล้วก็ไปขอทานจากเขา They said Jarasandha likes to give give charity to the Brahmanas. จารสันดาเนี่ยชอบการให้ทานกับบรามนะ So u d a v a said, "Go and ask Jarasandha for a fight." แล้วก็แล้วก็เขาเขาก็บอกว่าแล้วก็ควรที่จะขอจราสันดาในการที่จะต่อสู้ And you should take Krishna with you because Krishna will be a good help when you have to fight Jarasandha. แล้วก็ให้พาคริชนาไปกับเธอด้วยมาจะช่วยได้ตอนนี้จะต่อสู้ They said Jarasandha. They said Jarasandha has the strength, the strength of ten thousand elephants. เดลสันดาเนี่ยมีพลังกำลังเท่ากับช้างหนึ่งหมื่นเชือก And only person who is equal to him who can never who could give him a good fight the only person is Bima 
้แล้วคนที่จะมีภาระกําลังมากพอที่จะสามารถต่อสู้กับท่านได้เนี่ยก็คือบีมะ All right, so we're going to read more. So Prabhupada says, oh, "Prabhupada's written." He said, "Actually, well, this is uh, this is the words of Uddhava speaking to Lord Krishna, and he said, 'Actually, you create and destroy the entire cosmic manifestation.'" อันนี้คำพูดของมุดดาวที่กล่าวกับกิชนาบอกว่าอันที่จริงเนี่ยพระองค์ทรงเป็นผู้สร้างแล้วก็ทำลายปรากฏการณ์ในจักรวาล It appears like Lord Brahma and Lord Shiva are doing it, but actually we know that Krishna is actually doing everything. แต่ว่ามันจะปรากฏเหมือนกับว่าพระพรหมหรือว่าพระศิวะเนี่ยเป็นเป็นผู้กระทำสิ่งนี้แต่ว่าเรื่องหลังแล้วเนี่ยคือเป็นมือของพระกิชนา And Krishna does everything by the time factor. แล้วก็ฉันเนี่ยก็ทรงกระทำทุกอย่างตามการเวลาที่เหมาะสม The time factor is the impersonal representation of Krishna. การเวลาก็คือการเวลาที่มองไม่เห็นซึ่งเป็นตัวแทนอันไร้รูปลักษณ์ของกฤษณะ And everything is under the control. Of the time factor. แต่ทุกสิ่งทุกอย่างเนี่ยก็อยู่ภายใต้การควบคุมของการเวลา So if the time factor can perform wonderful acts through Lord Brahma and Lord Shiva, then we know that Lord Krishna can do even things more wonderful. หากการเวลาที่มองไม่เห็นเนี่ยของพระองค์สามารถทําสิ่งอัศจรรย์ได้เนี่ยแล้วโดยผ่านทางพระพรหมราคาสิวะเนี่ยแล้วแล้วพระองค์ก็ทรงน่าจะทําปรากฏการณ์ที่อัศจรรย์ได้หลายหลายอย่าง And we know that if you go there, if you go with Bima to Jarasandha, then you can help Bima to conquer Jarasandha. แล้วก็ถ้าเกิดว่าเราเนี่ยมาพาบีมาเนี่ยไปที่จาราสันดาถ้าพระองค์ทรงพาไปเนี่ยพระองค์จะทรงช่วยเขาแล้วก็ให้เขาเนี่ยได้รับชัยชนะได้ And when Jarasandha is killed, then the queen, the queens of all, all the imprisoned kings will be so happy to get their husbands back. แล้วก็กษัตริย์เนี่ยพวกหญิงสาวเนี่ยเขาก็จะมีความสุขมากที่จะได้สามีของพวกเขากลับคืนไป And they will all sing the glories of Lord Krishna แล้วพวกเขาทั้งหมดก็จะร้องเพลงสรรเสริญพระบารมีของพระกิษณะ Just like when Krishna free, just like when Krishna freed all the gopis the gopis had been kidnapped by this one demon Shankachuta, and Krishna killed him and freed all the gopis. So the same way, all the queens will be happy when they get their husbands back. นี่ก็เหมือนกับตอนที่พวกนางเนี่ยมีความยินดีเหมือนกับพวกโกปีเนี่ยเปิดที่เป็นอิสระจากเงื้อมือของชังคาชูระแล้วก็เขาซึ่งเป็นนักปราชญ์ผู้ยอดยอดเยี่ยมทั้งหมดเนี่ยแล้วก็เป็นเจ้าของเจ้าของช้างพวกเขาเนี่ยก็พอเป็นอิสระตรงนี้เนี่ยเขาก็ดีใจกัน And all the great sages and the king of the elephants Gajendra and the goddess of fortune Mother Sita and even your father and mother were all delivered by the mercy of Krishna แล้วก็ทุกคนไม่ว่าจะเป็นช้างกัจเจนดราแล้วก็เทพธิดาแห่งสีดาเทพธิดาแห่งโชคลาภและแม้แต่พระบิดาและพระมารดาของพระองค์ And we have, would have said we also have been delivered, and we also sing about the glories of 
Lord Krishna's wonderful activities. So Uddhava says, I think that if the killing of Jaras, if you if you will go and kill Jarasandha first, that will that will solve many other problems. And the Rajasuya Yagna, Rajasuya Yagna is going, and that's going to be done in Hastinapur. So it will be held, <coughs> it will be held because of the pious activities of the kings, of the, the all the kings. The Rajasuya Yagna will be able to, they'll be able to do it because of all the pious activities of the kings who Jarasandha put in the prison. Okay. So Uddhava says, it appears that you have to go personally to Hastinapur to conquer demons like Janasanda and Sishupal. And you can get the, all the kings who've been put in prison, you can get them free. And then Maharaj Yudhisthira can do the Rajasuri Yakna. So Uddhava so says, I think now after all this, we, I think the best thing you can do is to go immediately to Hastinapur. So everybody who was present in the assembly, they all agreed with Uddhava. They said Uddhava has spoken correctly. And they all agreed if Lord Krishna would go to Astinapur, it would be good for all the pious, all the all the all all the it'd be good for all the points, all the different points which would consider. So Narada Muni, he agreed with this, and all the older personalities in the Yadu dynasty, and Krishna himself, they all agreed with Uddhava. Uh, so Lord, Lord Krishna took permission from his father Vasudev and from his grandfather Ugrasena. He took their permission and he then got his servants ready to go to Hastinapur. Yeah, Krishna's servants are Daruka and Jaitra. They're both his servants and they go and travel. They're going to travel with him to Astinapur. So when everything was ready, Lord Krishna said goodbye to Lord Balaram 
and to the king of the Yadus, Ugratina. And then he got he also he got ready all of his queens and their children. And he and he and he got them all ready with all the luggage. And he got everybody ready, got them on the chariot, ready to go. So before they started the procession, before they started the procession, Lord Krishna first of all satisfied Narada Muni by offering him different items of worship. Now Narada, he wanted to fall at the feet of Krishna and worship Krishna. But Krishna was playing the part of an ordinary human being. And Krishna just offered his respect. Uh, Narada Muni just offered his respects in the mind to Krishna. And he fixed also the form of Krishna in his heart. And in this way, Narada Muni left the place. So Narada Muni, he doesn't walk on the surface of the earth, but he travels in space. So after Narada had gone, gone off in the sky, then Lord Krishna told the messenger who'd come from all the kings, the 20,000 kings who were in the prison. Lord Krishna gave that messenger uh, he get some instructions. Lord Krishna told the messenger that he should go back and tell all the kings that they should not be worried because he would soon come there and he would kill the king or he would kill Jarasandha. So in this way, he, he gave his blessings to all the kings and to the messenger also. So then the messenger went back to tell all the kings who are in the prison and tell them the good news that Lord Krishna is going to come soon. All of the kings were very happy when they heard the news and they were waiting very anxiously for Lord Krishna to come. And 
อย่างมาบอกอย่างแบบตั้งใจเลยเราพร้อม So the chariot of Krishna started for Hastinapur, and there were many other chariots. It was a big procession. There were elephants. There was infantry, and many royal paraphernalia. แล้วก็ในราชวัฒน์นี่ของ Krishna ราชวัฒน์ที่เตรียมไปเนี่ยก็มีเยอะมากมีช้างมีทหารมีม้ามีทหารลาบก็ And, and the, as, they, as they were moving, they were playing bugles and drums and trumpets and blowing conch shells and blowing horns. So it made a very great sound. And then, in the middle of the road, there was a sound of drums, trumpets, and other instruments. And Krishna brought all of his wives with him. All sixteen thousand queens came with him, headed by the goddess of fortune, Rukmini Devi. Krishna, he brought all of his wives with him. All sixteen thousand queens came with him, headed by the goddess of fortune, Rukmini Devi. And Krishna, he brought all of his wives with him. All sixteen thousand queens came with him, headed by the goddess of fortune. ลูกมินีเนี่ยเป็นภรรยาหลักแล้วเป็นภรรยาตัวอย่างของพระองค์เจ้าคริสต์นะ And the wives, the all the queens came and they also brought their sons with them, all their children, all their followers. They all came behind Lord Krishna. แล้วก็ทุกคนก็มาแล้วลูกๆแล้วทุกคนเนี่ยทุกคนก็มาตามทำมาลูกแล้วก็ทุกคนก็ตาม So everyone was dressed in very costly garments and decorated with ornaments. And to call it come again, uh, top bang, young D. And their bodies were covered with sandalwood pulp. And also they had many beautiful garlands, fragrant garlands around the neck. แล้วมีสร้อยคอปงมาลัยที่ใส่ไว้อยู่บนคอที่สวยงามมาก They were riding on palanquins which were all decorated with silk and flags แล้วก็นั่งบนเสลียงที่ประดับด้วยผ้าไหมธงแล้วก็ลูกไม้ขลิบทองอย่างดี So in this way all of the queens they all followed their Husband, the, the greatest husband, Lord Krishna. And accompanying everybody, there were many soldiers who were carrying swords and shields and lances in their hands. มีการเตรียมอุปกรณ์ไปด้วยบางคนก็มีดาบมีหอกมีอะไร All of these soldiers, they were all the bodyguards for all of Krishna's wives and queens. แล้วก็ทุกทุกคนเนี่ยทหารเราเนี่ยก็เหมือนกับเป็น bodyguard ของภรรยาของตัว And at the back of the procession were all the wives and children of the other followers. And they had even many society girls also following them. สาวสังคมตามไปอีกมากมาย And they used they used uh, bulls they used bulls and buffaloes and asses and they used many different animals to carry everything แล้วก็ใช้โคกระบือลาแบกของจากเต็นท์อะไร And the women, the women who followed, they were seated in palanquins. 
on the back of camels so it was a huge procession and it was accompanied by all the shouts of the people and there were many different colored flags and there were umbrellas and different varieties of weapons People were, they were all dressed in different clothing and ornaments and they had different helmets on. So in the sunlight, the sun was shining on the procession. It appeared like an ocean with big waves and sharks. So in this way, Lord Krishna's procession advance was walking, was moving towards Hastinapur, which is Hastinapur today is called New Delhi. So Lord Krishna was coming from Dwarka, and Dwarka is way over in Gujarat. And so he was coming all the way through Gujarat, and then he would come to the desert of Rajasthan, and then to Kurukshetra. แล้วก็การเดินทางเนี่ยก็ผ่านราชอาณาจักรของเอ่อเมืองกุจราตและก็เอ่อสุวีระซึ่งทะเลทรายอันกว้างใหญ่ในราชสถานเนี่ยแล
and all of his body hair stood on end in great ecstasy. And he came out of the city, Mara Yudhisthira came out of the city to receive Lord Krishna. And he ordered the different musicians to play different instruments and to sing songs. And all the Brahmanas, they would chant also the hymns of the Vedas loudly. So Lord Krishna is the master of the senses. And King Yudhisthira went forward to greet him. It said, Maharaj Yudhisthira was just like the senses going to meet the consciousness of life. Maharaj Yudhisthira so Maharaj Yudhisthira, he's a, he's an elder to Krishna. He's an older cousin. Maharaj Yudhisthira, also for Krishna. And so Maharaj Yudhisthira, he likes Krishna very very much. And as soon as he saw Krishna. He became filled with so much love for Krishna. He hadn't seen Krishna for many days. So he thought himself to be very fortunate to see Krishna before him. Maharaj Yudhisthira embraced Krishna again and again. So Krishna's form is eternal and it's the residence of the goddess of fortune. So as soon as Maharaj Yudhisthira embraced Krishna, he got free of any, he got free of all the contamination, material life. He could immediately feel bliss and he merged in the ocean of happiness. There were tears in his eyes and his body was shaking in ecstasy. And he forgot, he totally forgot that he was living in this material world. So Bhima saying he's the second brother of the Pandavas. So he came also and he smiled and embraced Lord Krishna. And he thought of Krishna just like it, but Krishna was his own maternal cousin. Abhima Singh was so happy, he was so full of ecstasy that he forgot his material existence. 
แล้วก็บิวเนี่ยก็มีความเพิ่มไปติสุขทิพมากเหมือนกันแล้วก็รู้สึกอิ่มเอิมแล้วก็จนกระทั่งรู้สึกว่าตัวรู้สึกลืมถึงความเป็นอยู่ทางวัตถุของตนเอง Then the other three Pandavas came and Lord Krishna embraced Arjuna and Nakula and Sahadev. และหลังจากนั้นก็เจอกับพี่น้องอีกสามคนก็คืออ r j u n a Nakula และก็ Sahadev. And when Krishna embraced them, all the brothers, all the three brothers, their eyes were filled with tears. เอ่อตอนที่กษัตริย์กอดทั้งสามและทั้งสามก็น้ำตาไหลแล้วร้องไห้ and especially Arjuna because he's a very very dear friend of Lord Krishna he was embracing Krishna again and again โดยเฉพาะ Arjuna พอเป็นเพื่อนรักมากของ Krishna ก็กอด Krishna ครั้งแล้วครั้งเล่า and the two younger brothers Nakula and Sahadev they fell down at the lotus feet of Krishna to offer Krishna their respects แล้วก็น้องสองน้องชายสองคนเล็กเนี่ยก็ก้มลงไปกราบที่เท้าของกฤษณาทั้งนกุลและสหเดช And then Lord Krishna offered his respects to all the brahmanas present. แล้วก็ท่านก็แสดงความเคารพต่อเราพรามทั้งหลายที่มาอยู่ที่นั่น And he offered his respects to all the older members of the Kuru dynasty. แล้วก็แสดงความเคารพต่อสาวหัวอุโสท่านอื่นๆในราชวงศ์กู People like Bhishma and Drona and Dhritarashtra, Lord Krishna respected all of them. ท่านก็เห็นหลายคนยืนอยู่ Bhishma ท่าน Drona Dhritarashtra กษัตริย์ทั้งหลายเนี่ยท่านก็แสดงความเคารพ And there were many other kings there. There were many kings from different places. So Lord Krishna reciprocated greetings and respects with them. แล้วก็มีกษัตริย์องค์อื่นอีกมากมายหลายคนแต่กฤษณาก็ทรงแสดงความเคารพต่อท่านทั้งหลาย And professional musicians were there, like people like the Sutas and the Magadhas. And the Vandis, they they were all there, but with along with the Brahmins, and they offered their prayers to Krishna. แล้วก็ก็มีหลายคนอย่างเช่นสุทาปัคคาแล้วก็วันดินะก็เป็นพรามที่มาร่วมด้วยกันเหมือนกันเขาก็ได้รับการแสดงความเคารพเช่นกัน And there were performing artists like the Gandharvas. แล้วก็เป็นนักศิลปินแล้วก็นักดนตรีอย่างเช่นพวกกันดาร์วะ And there were people jokers. They were their business was to make people laugh. แล้วก็มีตลกด้วยซึ่งตลกในงานของตลกก็คือทำให้ผู้คนหัวเราะ And they all began to play their different instruments and drums and conch shells and kettle drums. แล้วก็เริ่มเล่นพวกเครื่องดนตรีพวกหอยสางกองหน้าเดียวอะไรต่าง And they showed their wonderful dancing. They would dance to please, just to give pleasure to Krishna. แล้วก็เขาก็จะมีการเต้นกันเพื่อให้ความสุขกับ Krishna. So in this way, the all famous Lord Krishna entered into the city of Hastinapur. ในลักษณะนี้นะพวกเขาทุกคนก็มีความสุขแล้วพระก็เข้าไปในเมืองฮัสตินาพูร์ And when Lord Krishna entered the city, all the people talked about the glories of Krishna. และตอนที่กิชนาเข้าไปในเมืองเนี่ยทุกคนก็ร้องเพลงสรรเสริญคุณสมบัติของกิชนา And everyone praised Lord Krishna's wonderful qualities and form. ทุกคนก็ชมเชยกับรูปลักษณ์คุณสมบัติทิพย์ของพระองค์ and the roads and the streets all the even the lanes of Hastinapur they were all washed with nice fragrant water 
แล้วก็ทุกทีไม่ว่าจะเป็นถนนบนพื้นว่างทางเดินทางทุกอย่างเนี่ยก็ได้รับการทำความสะอาดอย่างดีด้วยนะ And they had elephants come and spray their water, spray water everywhere. แล้วก็มีช้างแล้วก็ช้างก็มาพ่นน้ำทุกที So in different places in the city, there were col col colorful flags. Archana, are you there? Miss a m i d a m a s i s a n Archana, are you there? Yeah. Yes, g o a s Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. I was saying, in different places in the city. There were different uh, flags and decorations. Everything was decorated. All the houses and all the streets were all decorated. Very nice. แล้วก็ทุกทีทุกที่ในเมืองเนี่ยทั้งทงมีการตกแต่งทุกบ้านทุกหลังคาเรือนเนี่ยมีการตกแต่งอย่างสวยงามอย่างสีสัน And where there was an important intersection, like a crossroad. Where two roads cross each other, then there would be gates with golden decorations. Now, when we have the c o m m o n a l t r a n s p o r t a t i o n t h e r e will be a g a t e with golden decorations. Now, when we have the c o m m o n a l t r a n s p o r t a t i o n there will be a g a t e with golden decorations. And at each side of the gate, there will be golden water jugs, pots of water of gold. แล้วก็ทางเข้าเป็นประตูเป็นทองแล้วก็จะมีเหยือกเหยือกน้ำที่เป็นทองเนี่ยตั้งไว้ So this is telling us about how opulent Hastinapur was อันนี้นะอธิบายให้เราให้ให้เราเข้าใจว่า Hastinapur เนี่ยเคยรวยมาขนาดเป็นเมือง So all the citizens had gathered and they were all dressed in nice colorful clothes And with many ornaments and flower garlands. แล้วก็อธิบายให้ฟังว่าทั้งทุกคนเนี่ยได้รับการตกแต่งมาอย่างไงบ้างมีดอกไม้อย่างดีมีเครื่องประดับอย่างดี And the houses were all lit with many different lamps. แล้วพวกบ้านเนี่ยก็ได้ทุกบ้านเนี่ยก็มีการตกแต่งโดยการจดไอจุด Uh, and the the lamps were placed in all the different corners of the house, and they were placed everywhere. แล้วก็เครื่องประดับนี้เนี่ยก็จะให้ทุกทุกเมืองเนี่ยทุกมุมของบ้านเนี่ยก็จะมีแสงไฟตกแต่งอยู่ And it was. All the different lamps they made. It was like rays of the, the rays of the lamps. That they showed how people were celebrating, like at Diwali festival. Just at the Hindu New Year, Diwali, they put the lamps around the house. So it was like that. The การตกแต่งที่บ้านเนี่ยเหมือนกับเทศกาลเดวาลีที่ชาวฮินดูเขาจะ And in every house, they were burning incense, and there was a nice aroma, the smell from the incense. นะทุกชาวก็จะมีทุกบ้านก็จะมีการจุดทูบกลิ่นหอมก็จะโผล่โผล่พัดไปทุกที So the whole atmosphere was very pleasing. เพราะฉะนั้นเอ่อบรรยากาศนี้เนี่ยคือเป็นบรรยากาศที่ดีมากมาก And there were decorations on the top of every house. เอ่อมีการตกแต่งเอ่อที่หลังคาบ้านของทุกคน And they even had golden water pots on the roof. แล้วก็มีน้ำตกเป็นทองจากเอ่อบนหลังคาSo in this way, Lord Krishna entered the city of the Pandavas, Hastinapur, and he enjoyed the beautiful atmosphere. แล้วก็ในลักษณะนี้เนี่ยก็ก็เป็นที่พระกษัตริย์ก็ไปถึงที่ฮัสตินาปูแล้วก็พวกพันธวัตก็ต้อนต้อนรับพระองค์อย่างดี 
And the young girls, the young girls, they all heard about Lord Krishna. And they knew that Lord Krishna is the only man worth seeing. So when they heard that he was passing on the road, they were all came out to see him. And these young girls, they had rushed to see Krishna. So their hair was loose and their saris were also slackened because they'd been rushing to see him. And they gave up all their duties in the home. They were so eager to see Krishna. And even some ladies, they were laying in bed with their husbands. But they immediately left and came to see Krishna in the street. So they saw the whole procession, all the elephants and the chariots and the soldiers. So it was very crowded. And not everybody could see properly. So some of the girls, they went up on the roof to see everything. But they were very pleased to see Lord Krishna and they threw, threw flowers on top of Lord Krishna. And, and within their mind, they were embracing Krishna. And they saw Krishna with all of his queens. It was like seeing the moon among all the different stars in the sky. So the different girls began to talk to each other. One girl said to the other girl, she said, my dear friend, it's very difficult to know what kind of pious activities these queens must have done. They're always enjoying the smiling and loving faces, face of Lord Krishna. Krishna. And when Krishna was moving on the road, some of the citizens who were quite rich and very respectable and pious, they gave Krishna different presentations, presented art articles to Krishna. So although these people were rich and respectable, they worshipped Krishna like they were his humble servants. Then Lord Krishna entered the palace and all the ladies there were so much full of love for Krishna. As soon as they saw Krishna, they immediately received him with 
their love and affection for him. So Lord Krishna smiled, is very happy to be received like this, that the, the, all, everyone's very nice to him. And then Kunti, she's the mother of the Pandavas, and she's the, the aunt of Lord Krishna. So she saw her nephew, Lord Krishna. So when she saw Krishna, she was full of love and affection for him. So Kunti, she's an elderly lady, and she was laying on the on down, and but she got up from her bed. And she came to see Krishna. She came along with her daughter-in-law, Draupadi. So Draupadi, as Kunti comes and she embraced Krishna. So Maharaj Yudhisthira is bringing Krishna into the palace, but he became so confused. He was so excited and so happy, he became confused that he forgot what he was doing. Uh, Maharaj Yudhisthira forgot that he's supposed to worship Krishna. But Lord Krishna is very happy to be with all the Pandavas and Queen Kunti. And so Lord Krishna offers his obeisances to Queen Kunti. And all to, and also he worships all the older ladies in the palace. And then Krishna saw his sister, his younger sister Subhadra is there, and she's standing there with Drupadi, and both of them offered their obeisances to Krishna. So Queen Kunti, she tells Drupadi, you know, to bring clothing and ornaments and garlands. And this way they gave everything, they offered everything to the queens of Krishna. Queens like Rukmini and Satyabhama and Bhadra and Jambavati, Kalindi, Mitravinda, Lakshmana and also Satya. These are the eight principal queens of Lord Krishna. แล้วก็แล้วก็เทพธิดาเอ่อภรรยาของของกัชชานาที่มาเนี่ยไม่ว่าจะเป็นเอ่อ first the eight principal queens were received and given nice presents and things gifts and then the other queens they all came and they were also received. They were also given a nice reception. So King Yudhisthira, 
he arranged for Lord Krishna to have a place where he could rest. And then he arranges for all the people who came with Krishna, all of Krishna's queens and soldiers and ministers and secretaries, they all have to be taken care of. And Maharaj Yudhisthira had arranged a new reception for them every day. So every day they stayed there in the palace of the Hastinapur with the Pandavas. Maharaj Yudhisthira would make a nice reception. So it was during this time that Lord Krishna, with the help of Arjuna, he arranged that the fire god Agni could eat the whole Gandava for could eat the whole forest of Gandava. Yeah, the, the Gandava forest, the Gandava, the, the fire god Agni had some indigestion and he needed to eat, a, he had to eat the fire in order to cure his stomach problem. So Krishna arranged that Agni could eat the whole forest. But when they, when they set the forest on fire, there was a there was a demon who was living in the forest called Mayasura. And that demon came to Krishna came to Arjuna for shelter. So Arjuna, he gave shelter to the Mayasura and the Mayasura was saved from the fire. So the Mayasura demon was so grateful, he wanted to thank Arjuna and Krishna. So he arranged that he, he built, a, he gave them a wonderful assembly house. He gave them this house in the city of Hastinapur, just to please Maharaj Yudhisthira. So Lord Krishna stayed in Hastinapur for several months. And when Lord Krishna was staying there, he used to go for walks. He enjoyed walking different places. And he used to also drive his chariot with Arjuna. Many warriors, soldiers used to follow him. So this is the end of chapter 71 of Lord Krishna in Indraprastha city. Krishna 
So next week we will hear how Jarasandha gets delivered. Okay, are there any questions today? Yes, Gurus from uh, Shaya Mataji, Yogita Mataji, and Vaishnavi Mataji. Okay. For the okay. So, Chaya, Vishnu Priya's question. Hare Krishna, Maharaj. Dandavat Pranam, please accept my humble obeisances. All glory to Sila Bhagavan. Um, Ajana ha kham tham hong pi khu. Pi khai an jo wa Kunti Devi ha. Kho phon Krishna hai hai. ให้ให้อ่าเผชิญความยากลําบากอะไรอย่างเงี้ยค่ะทีเนี้ยอ่าอยากให้คุณมหาราชอธิบายเรื่องนี้ให้ฟังหน่อยค่ะว่าถ้
ต่ว่าเวลาสิ่งเหล่านี้มันเกิดขึ้นเนี่ยมันเราต้องมั่นใจว่าเราคิดถึงคุณอะไรมากขึ้น Difficulties come for everyone, everywhere. We don't want them, but they come because that's the material world. ความทุกข์หรือความยากลำบากเนี่ยมันเกิดขึ้นอยู่ตลอดอยู่แล้วกับทุกคนอยู่แล้วเพราะมันเป็นธรรมชาติของโลกใบนี้ Okay. Thank you, Guru Maharaj, for your explanation. Um, now I'm so difficult, Guru Maharaj. I had accident last Friday, so I cannot walking. I cannot go everywhere. I cannot go to work. Really? Yes. I fell down from big step when I went market. Then um, I I'm wearing about a plastic. Case and um, my finger, fifth finger broken. Three fingers broken. Yes. Oh my God! Oh, terrible! And you cannot walk. Yes, Guru Maharaj. Oh no! How did you manage? Did they take it to hospital? Um. After I fell down, some. Someone I I don't remember called about emergency uh, hospital car to pick me up to to hospital, and I call my brother to to uh, he is not real brother, but um, he uh, went to hospital to see me and take care of me. Mm -hmm. So they must have cost you a lot of money. Um, I have um welfare from government, Guru Maharaj. Oh, okay, that's good. But it is not not like like payment hospital is, but it's okay. Uh huh. So your your brother took care of everything. Um, he didn't live with me, Guru Maharaj. So I live with only my mom. Um, I. I'm very difficult to move my body to to walk and everything, and and she cannot do. Um, I mean, she cannot take care of me, so I should take care of myself. Uh -huh. Krishna, I'm so sorry to hear this. This is very sad. Yes, after. After. I mean, after I I break up with with my fans and some very difficult came to my life. Mm -hmm. Well, these things, you know, it's it's not just because you break up with your fiance, but these things happen, you know. You mm -hmm. know, Prabhupada when Prabhupada became a sannyasi, when Prabhupada took sannyas, then he got gored. He got hit by the bull. The horns were stuck. p r o p e r and p r o p e r got very badly injured, and there was nobody to take care of him in Vrindavan. Mm -hmm. So some sometimes these things happen. Krishna just puts you in these difficulties, so you just try to take more shelter of Krishna. We cannot understand Krishna's plan. <laughs> But we hope that you can get better soon. Mm. Thank you, Guru Maharaj. Please, please bless me. Yeah, that definitely. We pray for you. Pray for you to get better quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Guru Maharaj, for your mercy. The, yes, when I uh, cannot do everything, I cry for Krishna. I cry. Right. Yes, I don't know about his plan. Now I I feel like he he bring my material life like he stolen. I cannot go to work. I don't know um, about if I came back to work. What is what will be happen? I don't know because I I cannot work 
in some time after COVID, uh-huh. I live is so long time. My you voice. Haven't been, you haven't been to work for a long time. Yes, I've, since I got COVID, Guru Maharaj. Uh-huh. And now you've got this. Yes. So we pray for you. We hope you can get well. We hope everything will become better for you soon. Thank you, Guru Maharaj, for your mercy. Hare Krishna. You please, you please keep in touch with the devotees. Yes, Guru Maharaj. Um, last Sunday on Radha Ashmi, my brother bring uh, me to uh, Bankhak Temple. I I can appreciate and saw Jaran Padma in shortly time. Mm-hmm. Oh. oh, okay, very nice. No, it's very I, good. Your brother, your brother helped you. Yes, he is very good seva. He is not real my brother, but he take care of me like like I am uh, real his sister. So um, I don't know. I sometimes I cannot touch Krishna. After I got COVID, I cannot um, chanting. I mean quality because I was sick. But I I still trying complete sixteen round every day. Maybe oh, without offense. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you please keep up your chanting. It's very important. Yes, try, but I. Try to- Yes, Guru Maharaj. But maybe some offense because um, I was, I still speak. Mm-hmm. Then I try to, I mean, I try to um, visit uh, Bankhag to join Radha Ashmi because I need, um, Radha need to see me. And please. Let Radharani allow me to get Krishna mercy. Okay. Very good. Thank you, Guru Maharaj, for your mercy always. Yeah. You please take care. I'll be thinking of you a lot now. I'll be praying for you. Okay, Ramesh, you've got three more questions. Okay. You're from Shama Saki Mataji. Shama Saki. Hare Krishna. Timbaikude,我所有奉献者,你自身主在四个年代里,分别以白,红,黑,黄,辐射显现。黄色和黑色我们知道 其结束时，我显现，为了就是给萨提亚瓦瓦塔王展示延迟，对吗？She's asking about the incarnation in the different ages, how they appear in different colors. So she wants to know about the white incarnation. อ๋อโอเคเอ่อคําถามนะคะถามเกี่ยวกับว่าอวตารแต่ละปางแล้วก็เรื่องสีของแต่ละอวตารนะคะมันมีความแตกต่างกันอย่างไรแล้วก็พ
มีขาวมีแดงมีเขียวมีฟ้ามีดำ So Lord Krishna, Lord Krishna, of course, is the black incarnation. He comes in the tree and in the in the d w a p a r a Yuga. Lord Krishna, he comes in the avatar, the color of the sea, and he comes in the Dwapara Yuga. And in the Kali Yuga, Lord Chaitanya comes. He's the yellow color. And then. Uh, Rabbi, But in the in the Satya Yuga, in the Satya Yuga, the Lord comes, teaches the the, the Yuga Dharma. In the Satya Yuga, the Yuga Dharma is meditation. And so, uh, there are different names mentioned. You have to read the Srimad Bhagavatam. You read the Srimad Bhagavatam, eleventh canto. And you'll see the information is there. There are several different names which that incarnation has. a h a m i l a e t n e t i b a i k a w a t a n e s a m a y s a t y u g a i p e n p a n g s i a l a i m a p a w a l a i l a n e t a m i t i b a i n e s i m a b o g a t a m p a k s u e t h a i p e a n t e r m t e r m d a i And then you have the red incarnation in the t r e t a y u g a and he's teaching about sacrifice. และตอนเทรดยูกาเนี่ยเป็นนวตาสีแดงจะสอนเกี่ยวกับการทำพิธีบูชาไฟ So there are also different names for that incarnation. There's about six different names mentioned there. มีประมาณหกชื่อที่ได้ระบุไว้ที่นั่น Okay. Next question from you at the Madhusudan. Uh, Hare Krishna, dear Guru Maharaj and dear devotees, please accept my humble obeisances. O oh, Guru Shushila Prabhupada, Guru Maharaj, it is believed sometimes that uh, uh, to think uh, that all the pure devotees, all devotees are pure, and I am most fallen. I am sinful like this. This is right uh, mood for a devotee, but uh, couldn't it lead the devotee to think that he is um, incapable of anything and give up Krishna consciousness because he is so sinful, he is so useless, he is so worthless? And uh, how can we avoid uh, this mood? Um. Did you get it, Archana? Um, how how do we avoid the mood of yes of, the of, mood that uh, we are know. that we are useless if we will think that all devotees are pure except me? Uh, I am the sinful. Uh, yes, like this. And uh, if I so sinful, I can um, I can give up this Krishna consciousness like this because I cannot. Uh, what will I do with you devotees like this? อ๋อโอเคโอเคโอเคโอเคบางครั้งเนี่ยเราแบบว่าคิดว่าตัวเองเนี่ยต่ำต้อยแล้วก็แย่แล้วก็เราคิดว่าเราไม่คู่ควรแม้แต่ในการปฏิบัติอะไรเงี้ยบางทีเราคิดว่าเราเนี่ยเป็นคนที่แย่มากบาปหนาแล้วแบบไม่ควรที่จะมาปฏิบัติแบบเนี้ยถ้าเราคิดอย่างนี้กับตัวเองมันดีไหมหรือว่าอย่างไง Well if one thinks himself fallen he shouldn't remain fallen He should make efforts to improve himself. That's the idea. That when when we think like that, we should think I have to improve myself, not that I have to remain or not that I have to continue to be fallen, but I have to elevate myself. I have to get out of that fallen condition. การที่เราคิดว่าเราเป็นสาวผู้ตกต่ำเนี่ยมันดีแต่เราอาร์เชนาอยู่เดียอาร์เชนาอาร์เชนาอ
Hare Krishna, Archana. Archana, are you back? Gumaraj. Are you back now? Sorry again. I don't know what's wrong today. Maybe because of the rain. That's why. Okay, Guru. Sorry. Please continue. So I was I was saying that one shouldn't remain like that. One may be fallen, so one should do something to improve oneself. You should make great efforts to do something to elevate oneself out of that fallen condition. แต่ถ้าเรารู้ว่าเราตกต่ําแล้วเนี่ยเราก็ต้องพัฒนาตนเองให้ตนเองเนี่ยเอ่อขึ้นมาจากอาการที่เป็นแบบว่าตกต่
killing the different demons, you know, it was all news, you know, people knew what Krishna was doing. They mm. knew how Krishna killed the demon Putana, and it was such a huge demon, and then Krishna went to Mathura, he killed Kamsa, and Krishna picked up the, you know, the people were hearing all about Krishna's pastimes, so they could, they could understand who is Krishna, just like the ladies of Mathura. When Krishna went to Mathura, all the ladies, they all knew, oh, Krishna's coming. And the wives of the Brahman, the Yagnapatnis, they all knew. They came running to give food to Krishna. So Kunti also knew who is Krishna. Although she is Krishna's aunt, but she was enlightened. She was in full knowledge of Krishna. Mm. You have to understand, she was born in a devotee family. Mm. She was born in the family. So she's in the family, but she's directly related to Krishna. Oh, and she has a very great soul. So mm. she can understand who is Krishna. True, Gurudev. Very true. Mm, very true, Gurudev. Gurudev, and then um, is it, how would we look at this point, Gurudev? Like when even uh, the sons have to go for Kurukshetra war, but she was still, I don't know if it was due to doubt or was it due to being scared for how they would get hurt or for some reason or the other, but she was still scared of the outcome of the war. Because if she knew Lord Krishna is the Supreme Personality of Godhead, then she should have been confident. Huh? That is why, Gurudev, I'm just a uh, bit... Should have been what? She, she, would, she should have been confident of the Kauravas, the, sorry, the Pandavas winning the war. But Oh, well, it's easy enough for you to say that. But if yeah, you're in that position, it's not so true. I mean, she already, she, she saw Abhimanus also get killed in the ah, battlefield. Yeah. There's so yes. many things happening. Yes. Mm. It's not just, oh, Krishna's God is going to protect us and nothing. No, you have to understand that Pandavas have already suffered so much and Kunti had been through a lot of suffering. I mean, she knew that Krishna's God, but still she went through a lot of suffering. Mm. So, right, right, good. Not that Kurukshetra, there's not going to be any more suffering. Yeah, there will be suffering. Mm. Mm. So how should we look at her doubts, Gurudev, or her... I mean, worries. I mean, what do you mean doubts. She doesn't have doubts. What are you talking no, about? No, good. I guess it's a TV girl that you see because we've seen the Mahabharata on TV. So the way that they, they, you know, they picturize it, it's a bit doubtful for her about them winning the war. But don't take any faith. Don't put your faith in the television. Things. Okay. Read the okay. books. Read the books. Read Srimad Bhagavatam. Mm. Yes, I haven't reached that part yet. That's why I was like, I'm still chapter, canto eight, sorry. So so that means she wasn't doubtful at all. She was already confident that yeah. it's going to be. Okay, Gurdiv, got it. Thank you very much, Gurdiv, thank you. Okay, Archana. Yes, Gurdiv, that's the last question we have. Okay, so thank you, Archana, very much. Thank all the devotees. We pray you We'll pray for uh, Vishnu Priya. You please try to get well soon. If you get a chance, Arjuna, maybe you go and see yeah. her. Okay, sure, good. Sure. I will try right to up. manage. Yeah, if you can. Keep in touch with her. Somebody near there, somebody's living near there. Is anybody living near there where she is? I don't know where she's there also, Raj. If you can come, so you have to find out. You should know. You know yes. You yes. Where are you? Piyu bang yai. Oh. Me kai yu kai. Me ke ke kai kun diao tu ne. Oh. Bang yai. Bang yai. Non taburi kuru maraj. Long taburi. Yes. Mm. Okay. Have we got any devotees over there, Long taburi? Mm, no, Guru Maharaj. 
Yeah, it's, no, not really. It's a little bit far from Bangkok, around one hour. Not from Bangkok. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Okay, maybe talk to Purnamasi, try to get Purnamasi to go do something. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we'll pray for you, Sarat Purnima, and, and maybe Archana and Purnamasi. Somebody will try to get somebody to go, go to be there. Thank you, Guru for your message. Try to help her look after our devotees. You also take rest and try to get better. Yes, Take care. Okay. Shri Prabhupada Ki Jai. Good day. Ki Jai.